up, Janky? I've got a cool thing here. Uh, so this is a uh, one of my favorite guitars. This is a new one. This is a custom-built High Tone Explorer. Um, it's a uh, kind of a uh, brand new, but it looks old. So uh, it's called a Relic Finish. I I love Mississippi. It's one of my favorite places, um, especially for the blues. So what I'm going to do today is I'm going to replace this pick guard with this license plate, Mississippi. I got the white one. Uh, decided the white over the black, um, especially because this is uh, Cohoma here, um, one of my favorite counties. And so uh, I'm going to replace this. It's going to fit like this right here. And it's it's pretty cool because this perfectly matches up. There's only going to be one spot right here that doesn't have the license plate, but I think that looks kind of cool. I mean, it doesn't have the, the pit guard, but I think that looks kind of cool. So otherwise, it's going to be perfect. So uh, here's the plate that I'm doing. And so what I did was I, I removed uh, this uh, screw, the nut on this, and I can just take this off. Uh, another tip, what I do on a lot of my guitars, uh, in case they're stolen, whatever, is I always try to mark my guitars with something. And uh, on this one, I put one of my stickers here, and I put today's date, uh, February 2019. That way, uh, if they're ever stolen, they end up in a pawn shop, I can be like, that's my guitar. So what I did is, uh, this is gonna fit here just like this. So being this like this, I put it in place, turn it over, and I use a uh, real fine Sharpie, and I drew along the edges here, right? So um, it looks like this, and what we're gonna do is, um, I purchased some shears, uh, tin shears they're called, or snips, yeah. Snip kit, um, aviation snip kit. And so I got the three different ones. This is a Craftsman. Um, I got bought these on um, Amazon pretty cheap. Uh, this is my first time to do this, but uh, shouldn't be that hard. So um, here's what I bought. I'm gonna get into it right now, bam. So real quick, what you have <clears throat> on these is you have a, a left turn. The yellow is center and the right is green. And uh, I think I'm gonna go down just this whole straight edge here with the yellow. So a little tip that I'm discovering is um, you, you got to get room for the scissors to get in there, the, the snips. So you, you just kind of bend it down a little bit to separate it. And uh, let me see here. So yeah, I'm going to bend the part that I'm cutting off, which is this part here. I'm just going to bend that up there. Pinch more off this side. Old 
new, old new. Uh, I did, I, I, th I thought it might be sharper than it is, and it's not really that sharp, I guess, because this is so thick. One of the things I did kind of notice that I did um, is it's beveled edges, so I kind of flattened them out a little bit so it fit on there better. You can use a crescent wrench or some needle nose, and then uh, cut my holes, uh, marked them. I went with one less hole because it's right on the edge there. Um, give her a gander and put this on. There. So I've got a set of rat tail files, and I'm gonna get the meatiest one. After a little finagling, I finally got this to be in the right position. I was really didn't want to go over the elm, but there was no other way uh, being with the position this is. But um, what I'm going to do uh, to kind of cover the hole, because you can see into the cavity there. That one, I gotta bend it up a little bit. Looks like. There it is, man. Uh, looks pretty cool. Again, this is a high tone, uh, custom handmade guitar, uh, relic finish, so it looks old, and uh, uh, very cool guitar. This thing plays amazing. It plays amazing. So I wanted to put uh, a little Mississippi on there. So I got my Coahoma County license plate. Uh, Use the, the snips here, uh, aluminum snips or tin snips, whatever you want to call them. And uh, I did replace uh, different positions some of the screws because um, this one was, it's kind of lift up based on the, the little uh, the letters here. And then I had a little issue here, but I backed the holes up with some scraps from the license plate and I think it looks pretty boss. Um, yeah, fits this guitar. Dig. Go check me out, getjanky.com, or subscribe to my channel. Appreciate it. Uh, support local musicians, blues music. Uh, we love it. So I play hill country. I play hill country blues and cotton patch soul blues. And uh, so uh, check me out online, man. Appreciate it. <laughs>